As you can see, that day win Kansas City's way as they won by 20 points. And uh, they're back to him this week. Your former teammate there in New Orleans. First time Reggie Corbin has had room to run, and he gets inside the 30-yard line. Offensive lineman, you see the pullers, more of a gap scheme type of a run. Watch Reggie as he gets into the cylinder, get into the briar patch. We call that the attempt. But they are last in passing offense by far. The only team averaging under 100 yards per game. Double pass here, and wide open inside the 10-yard line, and the 5. And into the end zone for a touchdown. 30-yard touchdown on the double pass for the Panthers. Ryan O'Malley. Going to go out to the right to the receiver. Receiver looks downfield. Sees Ryan O'Malley wide open, who is dressed today because Marcus Ball is injured, was inactive. Again, the former quarterback. They Joe said, Walker. I'll say, they said Joe Walker was gonna get a little active. Former quarterback, got to get him in the game. Hey, Joe Walker, two and a half years. Juwan Washington, they're without their normal starting tailback, B.J. Emmons tonight. Washington, hey, double trick plays here, and that one didn't work as well. Tamu picked it back up, fires downfield, caught by Dylan, and he'll find his way to the end zone. Non-traditional way of executing a non-traditional play. Your ho hum 50 yard touchdown. Get in the backfield. Flea flicker. Flea flicker. Ball's on the ground. Tamu has the wherewithal to still find his receiver downfield. Throws the ball up. Derek Dillon makes a play on the ball. This is. Look, look at the play call. Look at the play. You fake the blocking on the safety. Keep running. Oh, man. And what a play. What's Derek Dillon get rolling? Not too many people catching him. No. 429 Pro Day. LSU kid. Hey. Third down, 13, quick delivery, and a quick hit, and an incompletion. John Franklin crushed by Jamison Houston. The football as the, and he gets the football out of there. Great eyes, great technique on the tackle. That penalty, I'd say. Jamison Houston. Yeah. <laughs> No time to do it. And Mike, as you know well, former quarterback in you, it's difficult to read that 3-4 and know who's coming. Absolutely. And who's dropping. Fake Cole Murphy. Touch pass to Cam Scarlett. Great call and better execution. Murphy to Scarlett. Gain of seven. First down. Back there right there in the flat. Again, your new kicker punter. Okay, not punter kicker. Your new kicker punter throws a nice touch pass out there to Scarlett. Your new kicker, it, punter, quarterback. Kicker, punter, quarterback. There you go. <laughs> the, everybody the knows you can the more do. you can do. <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Look at Joe. Yeah, smile, Jeff. There you go. There you go. Quarterback throw it, of course. Oh, 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 oh. A wide receiver, hey, hey, hey. a punter, hey, hey, hey. Hey, hot, 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 and a hybrid tight end slash fullback. <laughs> Jay Patterson, third down. Good velocity and on time out to the 25-yard line for Jeff after the first four weeks when you combine extra points and field goals. The Panthers were just one out of six. Wow. One for one tonight already. One for one? One for one with the extra point. <laughs> Let's yeah. go. It's a good start. Cole Murphy, 71% at Syracuse. Started all four years and just sneaks that in. See if he keeps it here on third down and two. Play action in trouble. Wide open at the 20-yard line and up to the 10. Cheyenne O'Grady. Top receiver for these bandits. Boy, his first reception, pretty. Although we do have a penalty marker at the 38-yard line. But he's, he's helping out at running back tonight. Tamu to Washington. Struck at the one-yard line. Finds his way across the stripe. Touchdown, bandits. Good job by Jawan Washington right there. Jay Wash, as they like to call him on the team. He burrowed. Got low. Thank you. Michigan one timeout left. Patterson sliding in the pocket over the middle. Lance Lenore inside of Bandit's territory and then some. Yeah. Running down the far sideline, tight roping that sideline. A strike to Lenore and then he works. Um, he steps up in the pocket. See a little over route by Lance Lenore here. And Shea hits him in the second window. Oftentimes, quarterbacks hit that dig route in the first window. Shea waited on him. You know, we go to London here. We got here. We find out when my bye week is. I find out, you know, when we play divisional opponents. It was, it was a good night for me last night. And it came out right at dinner. That's not my fault. <laughs> <laughs> we understood.
Yeah, Bill Murphy one for one tonight from 36 yards out. Hey, that was a good decision to sign this Cole Murphy guy. Two for two. Oh my. Great chance here to put points on the board. Third quarter, about halfway through the third. Starting out in Michigan territory. Jordan Tamu pumps. Has Franklin open. Touchdown, Tampa Bay. They get Joseph Putu on the double move. 43 yard touchdown. You see the double move right here. Out and up. See you later. John Franklin is flying. Look at the throw by Jordan Tom. A little shoulder fake. Top shoulder. Throws a perfect pass in stride. Sixth round pick of the Patriots back in 2018. Patterson, quick drop, quick fire, complete to Lance Lenore. Good move, continues to work his way back. First down, Panthers. Lance Lenore makes a play. Rennell Hall eventually brought him down. Pitch and catch for 13. Bandits on the blitz. Patterson stays in, completes. Another first down, Michigan. Connor Davis, tight end, his first catch tonight. Tight end, and like they did there. And again, now out to the left as a wide receiver. Patterson lifts one down the far sideline. This time, Petway goes up and hangs on. Again, big, strong, tight end slash wide receiver, kind of a tweener. But when you're that big and the defender decides to press, to press the, to press the receiver, you got to win at the line of scrimmage. The defender didn't win and allowed. Easily worst in the league. Patterson feeling it tonight better than he has all season. He's in a rhythm. He's been talking about it all week. Rolls out to his right. Oh, had the ball tipped and picked. There you go. Tips equal picks. Hey, whenever you can get the ball in the air, it could be a good thing for the defense. Christian Sam had been in the backfield on this drive, making plays in the run game. Picks that one off to end the Panthers' drive. I mean, that's just that's good football right there. Hand up. Mm, gotta love it. Christian Sam, hey, just a playmaker. Coming in, wh whatever you want to call him, don't let him don't, don't, don't let him get a hold of the ball. But what you what you see is Reggie Corbin trying to block an outside backer. Okay, this is a sprint play, and you can't you can't cut guys on the outside of the tackle. Shea Patterson has options, right? Two wideouts to his left, one to his right. He's looking left, fires, has a wide open Devin Ross, hits him first down. Soft corner, exploited there, gain of 19. The guys in the box, they have to freeze. Keeps it himself around the left side, room to go. Another first down, Michigan. Great fake inside to Corbin. Really too hungry. Get off me. Averaging right at 100 coming in. Patterson's been feeling it on this drive. Into the end zone for Michael Petway. Got it. Touchdown, Panthers. Get him on the outside. Playing kind of like that flanker receiver. Takes an inside release and then gets back outside to stop to, to, to stack the defender and leaves the space for his quarterback, Shea Patterson, to drop the ball right in the bucket. LaMichael Pedway, he's had a big game and even bigger drive. Well, how good does Shea Patterson feel? He has not had a night. I was able to watch. <laughs> Tamu directly to the air. Franklin, good cut inside. And that's enough for a Tampa Bay first down, plus 11. He hit him with a double move earlier in the game. Jawan Washington will score. Lock ready. I love it. I love it. Jawan Washington right there. Look at the, the blocking on the outside. He gets into the briar patch, bounces the football. Before you know it, he's through. And if you didn't hear the hee hee hee, that's the gear shifting. That's, that's the gear. first. Look second, at that he jumped right third, there. hit fourth, hit the clutch. Ah, he's out of there. <laughs> he's out. And of course, when you. It's a flag, though. It's a penalty. No doubt. Here you go, Lakey G, Lakey G. Here's your Go. Four man rush. Patterson off his back foot. Cam Scarlett. 45. Hole knocked out from the backside. And the Bandits pounce on it. 
Greg Reeves knocked it away, and he recovers. Tampa Bay comes into this game last in the league in turnover margin. They produce two in the second half. Not so, not not just once, not just twice, but boom, over the top punch out. That's that's. You can't teach any better technique than that right there. When you're trying to secure the tackle as a defender, you come in with this over the top. Heavy hands. Punches are a ball right under. A lot of guys like to come under. You've been told just over the top is going to be the one that's going to get it out. It's and normally it, second one coming in, but he did it. He, he came leading in. I don't know who he thought it was. Mike Tyson <laughs> <laughs> he came in with Haymack. As a ball carrier, when you're cutting across the field. Hey, it's Trey Patterson. Thanks for watching this USFL video. For the best USFL fan experience, subscribe below and gain access to the best football content on planet Earth.